Welcome to My Life with Android. On today's episode, I will be reviewing the free to download game Eternity Wars. So, when you open it up, you have different selection of heroes to choose from. You have a fighter, a monk, we have the warrior. And, as soon as it goes there, we also have the Mage. It is a massive online multiplayer RPG game. When you go onto it and you've chosen whether or not you want to be a monk, which this character is, a warrior, which is that one, or a mage, which is this one just here, you then go on to starting the game. As you can see, uh, many of the references and influences come from such RPGs and online multiplayer games as World of Warcraft. So at the right we have the battle, we have friends, inventory, skills, store, offerings, guild, leaderboard and endless mode. So I haven't um, added any friends onto this but on the inventory I have been playing this for a bit so you get things like the armor and different weapons you get your helmets, your shoulder pads your parts for the legs and the arms it shows you the difference of levels and critical hits and other special abilities that the pieces have and compares it with yours and also lets you know if you're able to Put it onto your character at the level he is at the moment. This one is only six. Here we have the daily bonus. So this is day three. So I will just claim that. And it is an energy potion times two for when you're low on energy. We also have the skills tree here. So we have a new one. An orb of light appears each time you deal critical damage after three orbs appear. The next skill used will consume the orbs dealing 20% additional damage. So you get all your loads of different skills with money to spend on it. So I can learn that now because my money is just now under £4,000. Uh, in the store we have health potions, storm wings, wings of the light, uh, great wings of the light. But I don't have enough gems because I haven't gone enough up in levels to get them yet. And you can either do it that way or by buying the gems online through the game. There we go. So you get 199. 399, 799, 1599, all the way up to 77 pounds and 99, 60% uh, more free. Uh, these are the offerings. So you get different offerings that you can also grab for gems as well, with all their different perks, uh, how if they're common, uncommon, or rare. Let's have a look at this one. Shining Fist of Butcher, Mystery Treasure, Fine Chest Plate of Fortitude, Health Potion. So you get different things within these offerings. Let's go back. We have the guild. I'm not in a guild or anything. We also have the leaderboard as well. So you can see how good people are doing on the game. And you can also view your rank. I haven't been playing it enough to be ranked just yet. Uh, so we have the missions down here, or quests. So you get all your different quests that you can do whilst you're on the game. So you can claim the reward, because I've done that one. So quest complete. And I also level up. Uh, you can also go and do the quest by clicking fight just down here. This is another part to it where you where they advertise further products for the game and their own games themselves. You can also look at your mail if you have any, which I don't.
and the rewards tiers as well. So top playing rewards, online offerings. So this is pretty much the news part of the game which you get on most Android games. So you move the guy around by just moving your thumb in the direction he wants to go in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. Now let me take you through to one of the quests so you can see how the game works. So you go fight and start. So it's in normal mode. So the elves have maintained a peaceful relationship with man for centuries. While humans are unable to travel to their mysterious homeland, the elves have always come to aid the people of Yudar when needed. So it's just loading it up at the moment. There we go. And you get your different moves here. So you can, that is your normal fighting moves. You can destroy certain barrels and scenery. Here we go, here comes a fight. Come on, you can do it, kick it. You can do it, kick his head in. As you can see, the graphics are quite good. The gameplay is smooth as well. Uh, it's available for all Android devices. This is being done on the Samsung Note 10.1. But it is available for any other Android-based devices for free from the Play Store. So if you do like your online RPGs, then this is definitely one that I would strongly recommend in getting and giving it a good try and probably one to keep as well. So once you've finished each area you can go straight on to the next one once it's been opened. As you can see it closes there so you can't back away from any of the fights. Let me show you some of the moves so you get that one which is massive, massive fists. The special skills and trees vary depending on which character you go with, whether it's a monk, warrior or mage. And you get further skills as you go along and you can upgrade them as well. So here we go. I'm going, I'm going. As you can see, it's not, it is a simple RPG Android game of uh, just hit the buttons, but they do do uh, different moves depending on where you are in your skills and sets. So here we go, there's a chest as well. And I think that's it for this area. So let's continue moving on. Come on. There we go. Yeah, I got some more gold. The dead bodies do sometimes drop money and items as well, so it's always best to make sure that you haven't left anything behind before going into the next area of the level. And that was a quick move. As you can see, it takes a cooldown time periods as well, so you can't just constantly do special moves all the time. this will probably be near the end of the level because the levels themselves aren't that big in fact it is as you can see the boss's health has appeared Hiya again I boss Leo Oh I'm not quite sure what happened there There we go So you get the heavy you get the normal moves here you can dodge when he's firing with uh, that special ability. 
Ooh, I died. Ah, oh, well, I died on that uh, run through. So here we go with the normal adverts. But they don't hinder or stop you when you're playing a game. They come up at a nice time, like just then, at the end of a level. So I'm not going to use that. You can revive just here. Obviously, I don't have enough. And you lose any items that you find as well, which is a bit of a shame when you die. Uh, but the game itself is well thought out, the artwork is great, the lore behind the game is in depth, so you can always find out new things about the world of Eternity Wars, and you can also just simply chat to people that are around your area. This is a really good online RPG game. As I say, one worth definitely downloading and trying if you really enjoy your RPGs. It is a 4 out of 5 game, and one that I should really play more of. But this has been my review of Eternity Wars for my life with Android. Please check out the rest of my channel for additional interviews and reviews. Thank you very much, I hope you enjoyed this. Remember to like and share and also subscribe but until next time i've been jackals this has been my life with android thank you very much for watching take care and bye